Today we're going to have a look at the embedded music on hold feature of the Mitel 3300. From the system administration tool, browse to system properties, system feature settings and system options. First of all we need to check that music on hold is enabled. If we scroll down, look for the option for music on hold, you can see there it's disabled at the moment. So we need to change that. And say yes to enable it. Next we need to check the music on hold source that we'll be using. Um, we can either use the embedded music on hold where we can upload a WAV file to the system or we can use a music on hold port on the rear of the Mitel 3300 chassis. This system is a virtual Mitel 3300 so we'll need to use the embedded music on hold. If we go to system access point, click change and see for music source in the drop down, choose embedded and save. Next, we need to upload the music file to the system. To do that, if we browse to music on hold and then choose system audio files update, Make sure the audio source is set to zero, system MOH default. That's the default music on hold source. So whatever we upload to that source as a WAV file will play basically to every call that we place on hold. People queuing in ACDQs, if we transfer a call, people also listen to music on hold at that point. We need to find a suitable file, so I'll click browse. In this case, I've got a folder called music on hold files and a default kind of hold music.wav file. This is a, a fairly simple copyright free music source. Click open, sit in the window at the bottom there and then click update. Once the music file has been updated, we just refresh the form there. You see the audio source has now changed to zero holdmusic.wav, basically the name of the file we just uploaded. And we can see there we've still got some free space if we need to upload additional music sources for ACTQs and the like. Pretty straightforward process. If you'd like to know more, please visit our website or call us to arrange a demonstration. Thank you.